And as is traditional to hand over her crown, will you please welcome Miss World 1999, Yukta Muki. <laughs> Yeah, here comes Yukta Muki from the northern part of India. Yukta took the crown in London last year. She's had a very busy 12 months. Uh, 12 months which culminates in this, the handover ceremony. It must be a very emotional time for Yukta. It's very nice to see you. Very nice to see you. And you know, you must be thinking, I mean, you have carried on, uh, you know, your title with such grace. Now you're in the final moments uh, what goes through your mind knowing that this great experience of a lifetime is about to be over? That I hope um, the place that I have secured in people's hearts should live on even years after I've died. Good for you. <laughs> now I see why you won. <laughs> what is, uh, and then we'll get, best memory, best memory of the year. I got a standing ovation um, from about 800 people when I went for the ballroom dinner after I was crowned. And I didn't know why they were standing up and clapping. And then I realized they're giving me an ovation. It's really overwhelming. And other than that, I think one of the most touching moments was to realize that in spite of being in a position where you're probably walking down red carpets and you're sure. wearing expensive jewelry, you're being treated in royal dinners, but at the same time, you are also able to be in a position where you can put a smile on a small and sick child's face. I think that helps draw a wonderful balance between the extremities of life. Good attitude. Yeah. I see why the crown lies well upon your head. It's a very level head you have. Okay, that's it. Nice talk, but you're out of here. You know what I mean? So there you go. You <laughs> that's an American kind of thing you do. Ladies and gentlemen, okay, how about a nice hand for Miss World 1999?